Hi everyone, Kieran Viato here. Same day again. Anyway, let's get back into RuneScape. Um, we've made two videos now. This will be a third. Oh. What should we do on this one? I know what I'm going to do first. I am going to use my keys. I've got eight. Okay. Um, I'm going to go to a bank first. I'm just going to shove all that in there. Take that. Okay. I did make a mistake with one of them then, but it's all good. Right, what do we need? Divination on there. Oh, we need to sell that out. Okay. Got some more on there. Yet. Okay, we've got twelve of them. Um and we've got six of them. Okay. 
We're gonna go and use these. The higher up your skills are, the more quests you can do. That's why I'm trying to get all of my skills up, not just a specific few. Because some quests you can't do if your level's too low on a certain skill. So more quests will show up. Okay. What is that? Okay. We'll deploy this first. a really good thing about the game, the fact that you get keys and um, rewards and stuff because it can help you to boost up your levels quicker, otherwise it would take forever, it would take way too long if you didn't have that option. Especially with skills like that one. So, dummies and lamps, and that's that's a dummy as well, it's just a different type of dummy and that, are the best things to win, other than money. And protein planks. If you get anything protein, get protein planks. Because you really don't want to be doing all that moving around to get all different planks every two minutes for your house. So just get protein plants as many as nine hundred milestone, which is nine hundred um, levels in total of all skills. Oh. Okay. And we're gonna plug this back in because otherwise it will play love soon and I don't want to accidentally carry on playing while it's about to die. I wonder if we'll get more than three videos done today. We'll see. I like to keep it going for as long as possible because obviously I know um, how I'd like it. Like if I watched a YouTuber, I'd want to watch a video. Well, I don't whether it's every day or not. But if I was into it and there was a certain consistency that's gone on for a while, I'd probably want to want to see them keep it up because I'd get used to it a certain um, consistency and I'd be into it and I'd be like okay I want to watch the next one so I don't want to you know have you guys waiting for um, a video when it's when you've got used to a certain consistency I know I'm only really meant to be doing videos every Saturday but I ended up doing this and you know I'd just do a load in one go and then have it premiered up every, for every day for you. I'd say it's better, I don't know. But there will be times when um, I do run out of premiered videos and sometimes I won't be able to do a video. But as you all know, I do have two toddlers, so yeah. You can't always plan everything when you have two toddlers because plans don't always succeed. 
but we're leveling up very, very quickly in this skill, which is good. Until, we're, until we run out of dummies. So yeah, that's why I say dummies and lamps. You need them. Because it does this. It levels up a lot quicker. Don't just rely on dummies and um, lamps though, you have to do the work as well because otherwise it's just going to take too long because you're not always going to get lamps and dummies. As you all know, it's took forever for me to get those dummies. It's took like however long I've been doing these videos to get that many in one go. So. Yeah. Oh. Ow. I think my ankle locked now. <laughs> I've got used to wearing my um brow now. <laughs> I literally was like the first three four days I was like this is so uncomfortable so I was like just keep it on and get used to it just keep it on look look I'm trying okay <laughs> but yeah Before anyone asks, I don't know why I didn't use the web brown. I just don't. I just don't know. <laughs> I think I think I would have just seen them as really uncomfortable and thought, no, I don't I don't wanna wear it. And plus I also you know, like five years ago, maybe longer. Nearly six years ago, um, as some of you know already, I was dying and um, I didn't really have the will to live back then. So you can kind of understand why I didn't really care about brass. <laughs> but um, yeah, just lately I've been like, I think I want a bra. And mainly because I got a dress and I can't wear that without a bra, otherwise everything would be completely visible. <laughs> and I mean everything. So I was like, no, I can't do that. I'm going to wear a dress. And I'm going to be in public. And I'm going to be in view of people. I need to have a bra on. Yeah. And um, yeah, also it's because I'm actually thinking that I do want to settle down now with a new person. Um, so I kind of want to be ready and prepared for you know, like dates and stuff, hence the dress. Um, I haven't got anyone in mind I just I know that it's gonna happen at some point I am gonna meet someone at some point I always do um, so I kind of wanted to be ready and prepared and you know, like get a dress just in case a date comes along because otherwise I'm gonna be like oh my god I've got, I, I've got nothing to wear and I'm going to a restaurant can't go to a restaurant and normal clothes I mean you can but it it's, it's not the greatest no not the greatest I am topping up on stuff <sighs> for my future love life um so that 
you know, it's better. I don't want to feel like a, I don't know. I don't want to feel insecure when I first meet someone again. So the best thing to do is be ready for when I meet someone and have the clothes that I want to have when they're around and stuff like that. Yeah. I'm not the type of person though that cares what I look like half the time and I, I, I'm probably going to end up meeting them like somewhere public and I'll probably have like jeggings on or this or something like that. I don't care about that. It's obviously the dating department like if I get asked out on a date I want to be ready I want to have the stuff. Um, okay yeah I want to have this stuff ready and I don't know how do I put it um move on from that subject because I think I'm starting to ramble now but my hair still it's still not ready it's the length I want it for now because I am going to grow it um, I also need to get my nose pierced again and I need to get this white blonde because that is what I want <laughs> And no, it's not for a guy, it's not for anyone, I mean, it's for me. I don't want to meet someone and then feel insecure and, like, not my best self. I want to be my best self and I want to feel good to myself, like, the best I can. Um, as... It's important for self-love, self-appreciation, and to feel like the best version of yourself. Especially when you meet someone, because otherwise you've got in the back of your mind, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I am not my best self at the moment. I do not look my best self at the moment. And this is just gonna go kaboom. And then because obviously you've got those insecurities, it's even worse because then you're trying too hard and mess it right up. Yeah. <sighs> Best advice that I can give anyone is do not think about a love life if you are not feeling secure. If you feel insecure you don't love yourself and you're like how would I put it you're like a nervous wreck I would not I would not get with anyone or even think about it because that is gonna ruin it it's gonna ruin it you might not think it but it, it, it will it will cause arguments it will cause you to feel sick. And then you'll end up blaming them for something that they haven't done, most likely. Or you will unintentionally sabotage it because you don't think it's going to work. So just just think about that before you, you know, go ahead and go out with someone. And if you have a lot of healing to do, I also wouldn't suggest it because traumas and side effects of abuse can interfere with your relationship so it would be best to heal first just, just putting that out there um, and if I sound like an air hostess it's because I have a cold as you all know
Um, and, uh, I'm just talking. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm making the video more interesting because all she's doing is hitting bunny. So I'm rambling. Oh well. Um, I have no one that I know in mind. I have. I haven't got the best crust for past people. Obviously, I don't need the press. It's just we don't work together in a relationship. We're, just, we're better as friends. Um, and I want a new person. I want someone I've not met before. Or at least someone I've not had a thing with. Because going backwards is just not the way. It's just not the way. Once that connection is broken, there is no fixing it. There is no fixing it. Because it will always be there. The history will always be there. All the mistakes will always be there. All the damage will always be there. It will not go away. It will just linger and get worse and worse and go each time. So, there's some more advice for you. Never go backwards. Never go for an axe. Never go for a path lover. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. <laughs> it's never the best idea, is it? Just going around in circles. And if you've noticed as well, even if you spend ages away from someone, you will still go back to the original point. You will go back to exactly the way you were with them the last time from where you left off because for some reason that is set that way it doesn't matter how much you've changed you will still be the same with that person so just don't go back you your growth will just go down the toilet you will go down the toilet and you'll go backwards, not forwards. Just don't do it. Please save yourself from that. Just don't do it. <laughs> um. And um, how long we've we been doing it now? Like two months, three months? I don't know. I don't even know where membership is meant to run out. Would it be well if I doubt? I don't know if we're actually leveling up here. I've not really been paying attention. 72. Have we leveled up at all? In magic? No. Have a better idea. Oh no, finish that one first. We're gonna train the rest on like swords and bow and arrow. Yeah. Pause. <clears throat> Ow. It takes too long with the dummies. With magic now. Because I do the elite dungeons, so. I'm going to do the elite dungeons to skill up on my magic and I'm going to level up on swords because strength is always a good thing to get up because that's needed for a lot of things in this game. Okay, we need a sword. Have we got a sword? Have we got a decent one? can have me thrill. We could just use that for now. Range? No, it's fine. It's all good. Right. Um, and that can go there. Oh. Okay, we need that on. I don't 
don't need that on. We need that on. And we need, I think we've already got the cape on. Hey, go and see. Okay. Um, why have we not got it sold out? Where the hell did that sword just go? Because it's not there. Did we drop it? No. Well, oh, that is very strange. Right, we're just going to go and buy one. Oh, where are you going? Go that way. I think it's me, Frill. after that because I have a feeling I'm going to be going above that. <laughs> Adamant. Okay. Okay. else we need to do. Mine keeps going blank, blank after I've um, checked. Okay. And you've got that. Right. was really quick.
talking about level 90. Our combat level is still not high, by the way. There is people way above me. How do I uh, show you? Um, well, when I've looked at like things about this, those go up to 120 each and that ups your um, combat level um, and all of them including prayer <coughs> so if you think my level is high up no still not high It's high up enough to like do a lot of things on the game, like do elite dungeons, but not tank or get hit by anything properly, um, and do a lot of quests. But it's not high enough to do other things. And the higher your combat level, the more the more stuff you can receive when you're doing elite dungeons, and the more money and um the more quests you can do yeah i'd always say um focus on your combat level quicker than your others because the combat level is needed for pretty much anything especially if you want to make money and stuff otherwise it takes decades these are going so fast But in all honesty, it's not really leveling up quick, is it? That's because of how high it is, I think. <sighs> and there's all... There's also um, things that you can get when you're at the highest level of stuff. Um, so that's another reason to do it. Okay. Thirty eight yeah, is good enough.
those, by the way, that I've just put on, the boots, they are good for building up your agility. And as you all know, agility is needed for a lot of stuff. I'm definitely missing something. Where's the top? Okay. How far are we in? Wow, we spent 37 minutes doing all that. Is that how long I was talking for? Okay. That went really quick. Um, there's no point in doing something that takes ages, so... Um, oh, and those take a while. Um, <coughs> I think we'll leave this video where it is because then we can start another one and um, I keep losing track we can start another one and do something longer Anyway, thanks for watching, stay tuned and toodaloo mofos.